Hello and welcome. We're going to be checking out the Dawn Trail Benchmark trailer today. Very excited for this. I'm so stoked for Dawn Trail. And uh, yeah, normally we get to see some really cool stuff in here, including like shots of the areas and stuff like that, as well as some gameplay when it comes to like combat with the new jobs. So let's check it out. So nervous. Excited. Nice remix of the Dawn Trail theme. Good to see a chocobo there on the ship, too. You know, we're bringing our chocobo with us after all. I'm assuming. It is pretty loud. I'm going to bump it down a little bit more for you. I might bump it down a little bit more for me. There we go. That, that should be reasonable. Okay. Show me some stuff. Okay. I do like the Viper gear. The Viper gear looks really nice. I thought for a second we were gonna get an animation of like actually like hopping up on the Chocobo. I understand why we didn't, but this is a really pretty area. I wonder if these benchmarks would be on lower settings, I'm assuming. Because I know we're also getting the graphical update. Okay. It looks nice. It really does. It reminds me a lot with all the palm trees and stuff of Lenosia, but there's definitely enough other types of trees in there to offset it. Here's some combat, right? Okay, we're gonna have to see if we can recognize anything here. That was Gunbreaker. That was Dragoon. That was Sage. That's Black Mage. We're gonna come back and watch this part. That was Scholar. Dancer. Okay. Okay, so that'll be an S rank. Looks like a new cone AOE for that was a what was that? Was that a whip? Okay, you get to fire the, the big butt saw. I'm here for it. Nice new summon for ninja. Okay, big cut for Viper. Again, we're going to come back and watch all of those again. Maybe in slow motion. <laughs> Try to pick them all out, but... All right. New botanist gear. Fishing, mining. All for it. Smithing. I almost have all of my crafters leveled up for Dawn Trail. Almost. Okay. I'm digging that design. Look at that Dark Knight gear too, man. That Dark Knight has to be like a character, right? I really like these guys. Just... They feel very FF11 to me. Yeah, that's a character for sure, right? Mamas! Or alpacas, maybe? Probably alpacas, right? Ooh, I like that. That's a good looking zone right there. It's got a very much like Ozim Step feel, but with a different vibe to it, if that makes sense. Okay. So this will be one of our dungeons. I'm digging it. Oh, from the trailer. Doesn't look like he's the final boss of the dungeon, though. I mean, he still could be, but... Okay, there's Picto getting to do some cool stuff. That's Dark's new ability. 
Okay, there's Scholar. There's Reaper. Bard, of course. Very nice. And then here's Vipers. Is that Limit Break? This will be Limit Break, right? We normally end these with a Limit Break of some kind. Yeah. Very nice. We're almost at the end of the trailer. Very cool. Very cool. All right. So let's jump back here and get some of the combat. But real quick, as we get into this, uh, awesome benchmark. Gets me super stoked for Dawn Trail. Right around the corner. I want it so badly. All right. Let's bump the audio back here because we're going to be jumping around and skipping a lot. And let's see here. So we're going to bump the speed down to half speed. All right, we're going to go ahead and mute here. And all right. So we have Sage doing something over there. So Gunbreaker, big explosion. The Gunbreaker is getting another like danger zone upgrade maybe this is dragoon we have a huge i'm guessing that's nidhogg's wing it looks like that has come up so we're getting to use the wing i wonder if we're also going to get to use the tail then here this is a new sage ability sage is my main so we'll back this up here it looks because there was a dosis it looks to me like this is Toxicon, like an upgraded version of Toxicon, maybe. Then we have a new... It's a really interesting animation on that, too, from the Black Mage. It looks like maybe a new Thunder spell. Like a Thunder Finisher, maybe? It's going to be interesting to see. I'm excited for the Job Actions trailer. I really, truly am. I love that, that cutting that into the floor and then bam... That looks great. Then we get over here is, I'm guessing this is Summoner. I do not mean to keep cutting back all the way to here, but we'll see that Thunder Attack again or whatever that is. Shatter, maybe. So that looks like, it almost looks like a Flare. Big ball of energy that explodes. But then they've got, yeah, that's that's Summoner right there. So some kind of big finisher, maybe? This is not a summon, is it? This is not Leviathan. This is one of the things they're fighting, right? Because it doesn't look like it comes from this thing. But that is attacking that. It looks like this, it could just be part of the animation of it attacking one of these people. But it looked like it was attacking that. Levy summon, maybe? Then we have Monk. Okay, all right. Big tiger strike here. You can see the head of the tiger there. I'm digging it. Maybe a final uh, finisher for Coral style when you get the, the form shifts. Then we have Dancer doing a big... cut there okay so that is one of the enemies that's not a levy then because we see dancer doing it to this enemy so yeah that's not a leviathan that's a shame i was kind of looking forward to leviathan summon but that's okay that's okay i don't know how i feel about summoners thing being shown off here just being a big explosion but if it flows well with the rest of summoner then you know hey i'm all for it then we have i think it's in the next combat sequence where we get to see more stuff because, yeah, uh, Warrior of Light here, he jumps forward. I don't think there was anything shown here. Yeah, that's just people fighting. So he jumps forward to down here, and we get to see the next set. So we have... Yeah, as he comes in, we get the Viper hit. Paladin does what looks like a cone AoE, maybe? And then we cut over to Red Mage, who has some kind of, like, whip attack here, it looks like. Yeah, they're throwing something here.
They hit him with something, and then it coils back around. That's very cool. Then we get a big, big attack from Samurai. Big buzzsaw from Machinist. Very nice. Astrologian does... Big heal, maybe? We get a new frog from Ninja? I haven't seen anything from Warrior in this. Did we just miss it when we when Viper first came in here? When he's flying in? Because there's a Warrior on the other side. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not seeing anything from Warrior here. But we do have one more like little combat sequence here. Okay. So as we get into the fight here, Scholar. Okay, I'm not seeing anything specific there, though. But as we get into the final fight here, this is when we get to see Viper starts fighting. It's funny because he's not a tank. Picto gets the Moogle Beam. White Mage does big heal. Looks nice. Dark Knight does this cool Abyssal Slice. Scholar gets, okay. Nice with the gears. Reaper does this big slam here. Bard has a new arrow move that looks pretty nice, digging all the arrows that fall. Warrior must have been somewhere in here, and I missed him. There's no way they just didn't show Warrior. I just, I refuse to believe they didn't show Warrior at all. Everybody else got shown off. Oh, of course they showed Warrior. It's the block. Warrior is this block right here. I'm so dumb. So he does the big hit here. He goes to go in for the final move. Oh boy does his jump attack. And Warrior dives in and blocks it. With that new shield. That's what Warrior gets. Okay. Yeah, and then this will be... Viper's Limit Break. Yeah, personally, great trailer. Loved it. Looking forward to uh, Dawn Trail. Looking forward to the Job Actions trailer. Sorry it took us so long to hunt all that down, but hopefully it helped you because uh, I was too excited. I had to know. I had to see at least one new thing that everybody got. But until next time, I've been Trey. This has been the Full Spectrum. Remember to always enjoy the Full Spectrum that after 14 has to offer.